There's a name I often hear, one that fills me with a very strange feeling. A feeling of wanting to not say the words. And it rhymes with puppy lunch. And that name is Jack Stopper. Yes, today we're doing the fifth Jack. No, I'm just, I'm just messing with you. I'm sorry that it's not even April Fool's. I can't even make that April Fool's joke. <laughs> If I were a real genius, I'd release a fifth Jack Stopper video on April 1st. But I'm not that diabolical. But no, this isn't a Jack Stopper video. This is in fact a Lumpy Touch video. But who should we be talking about in this Lumpy Touch video? Probably Lumpy Touch. But I come to you all in a time of great need. I feel like I need to get terrified again. I feel like it's been a really long time since I've watched something that's made me scared or something that's really gotten me kind of the heebie-jeebies, as they say. But hey, last time that we checked out some Lumpy Touch videos, I think we had a really good time. Sure, uh, we dealt with a lot of Garfield and a lot of Gorefield, I guess, and a lot of lasagna. I'm actually thinking of making a t-shirt that has lasagna on it because I just think that's such a good phrase. But Lumpy Touch has so many other videos that we just didn't get a chance to check out. There's just so many of them that are beautiful in the most terrifying kind of way. I mean, look at that one. What the crap? Why? But there is actually something I wanted to start out with in this video. Something that Lumpy Touch created that I have purposely not been looking at because I just want to experience it with you all. But don't let me explain it. Lumpy Touch actually created a teaser for it. So let's check that out, shall we? Oh, I'm special? Oh. Hold on. Can we just point out the fact that Lumpy Touch just called me special? Oh, you. You are unique. Oh, that's why. What's gonna happen? Gorefield is hunting you. All right, I've gone down the rabbit hole far enough. I'm done. I, I, I don't need Garfield looking for me, okay? He, he, he's not someone I look forward to meeting. All right, you see that face? I don't want to meet that face. A new series by Lumpy Touch, or by Lumpy, excuse me, featuring Garfield designs by 12 different artists. Ooh, beautiful. You are special. You are John. Oh. So, if you didn't get it, what the basicness of this situation is, is that these clips are about two minute long horror scopes. Not horror scopes, horror scopes. In other words, you're gonna be terrified while you're watching them. And I'm already terrified and I haven't watched them yet. So, there are actually all 12 of the horror scope signs here, so if you haven't yet, go watch your own personal Luppy Touch version. In this video, we're gonna be checking out mine, which is Aries. And I'm not saying I'm special or anything, but Lumpy Touch released mine first. I'm just, I'm just saying. Yeah, mom, did you hear that Lumpy Touch released my horoscope first? I'm actually kind of scared. You did it. You found me. Oh. Aries, the volatile. A fighter unwilling to accept their destiny. Your lucky item, places to avoid. Your lasagna in your Monday. My lucky item is a lighter. My places to avoid, cellars. Honestly, I hate cellars and I hate the fact that now I have to fear that Garfield's gonna be in those two. Oh. I don't think that's bad. Garfield doesn't know your location yet. The dream. I keep having the same dream. There's a large rock on my chest. It's so heavy, I can barely breathe. It takes all my strength just to keep the rock from crushing me. I wake up in a sweat. I think the dream is getting longer. Oh. Holy crap. Huh. Well, that's
that settles it. Gorefield didn't eat me. I'm still alive, baby. One of you probably died from him. <laughs> no joke, that is a really cool drawing though. Freaking William Burke, you did amazing on that design. For those who don't know, William Burke is the artist who started the whole I'm sorry John trend in the first place. What? We get the honor, we Aries get the honor of being drawn by the first man himself. The OG, the boss. I, do, <laughs> I really don't mean to be that guy, but the dream story has breathed misspelled. <laughs> All right, so that was freaking awesome. That horoscope stuff, and there's 12 of them. That's freaking awesome. I, I would really like to go through all of them just to see how cool they are, but you know what? I think that you should just go see them yourselves. Whatever your horoscope is, go check them out on Lumpy Touch channel. No joke, go do it. But you have to finish watching this video, okay? You, you can't leave. No, stop, don't, stop, don't go, no! All right, for those of you who don't know, Back in the olden days, there was a computer game called Ski Free, where you play a skier who was just going down a hill. And as you would go down the hill, you would get chased by a monster. And let me tell you, this monster was terrifying enough as it is. But guess what? Lumpy Touch himself has made a rendition of this in a video called Lumpy Ski Free. And uh, I, don't, I don't mean to over exaggerate or anything, but like, that looks terrifying. And the original monster was already terrifying enough while you were playing it because you were just kind of going and enjoying your ski trip when all of a sudden you'd get chased after and you'd get eaten. I don't know about you all, but me, I don't personally like getting eaten. That's just, but that's just me. And that is why I will never go skiing. Also, that's legitimately what would happen if you got caught in the game. He would eat you. I, ju I don't know if there was blood, I can't remember, but I know for sure that he would eat you if he caught you. The, imagine the terror. I didn't realize this my first time playing the game that that was going to happen. As a child, I was just enjoying my ski trip. All of a sudden, I get chased and eaten by a Yeti. This is why I have issues. I like how Lumpy didn't change the Yeti's design at all. It feels like he thought this key free Yeti was scary enough. All right, in keeping with the video game theme that Lumpy Tesh really seems to adore, we're gonna be checking out one called Lumpy Duck Hunt. And just by this thumbnail, this creature is gonna be super robotic and really, really unsettling. So let's not delay the inevitable. Also, if you're curious, I'm watching this at 10.30 at night. So, yeah, I don't think I'm gonna sleep tonight. Thanks, Lumpy Touch. Thanks a lot. Duck Hunt, yes, the most wholesome of video games ever. Oh. Oh, I don't like that at all. really scary Jesus Christ not to mention traumatizing if I ever get a dog lumpy touch you stay away from my dog I swear to God if you ever come near my dog and draw him like that I will thank you for actually doing the art it's probably you probably did it for free well now that I'm thinking about it I feel like 
we should go support Lumpy Touch. This isn't the end of the video, but I'm gonna kind of sprinkle it here in the middle. Go to Lumpy Touch's Patreon channel and support this individual. You can tell they're doing all this art and freaking animation just beautifully. Sure, it's scary. Sure, it makes me have nightmares. Sure, I'm traumatized, but that doesn't matter because this art is great. If you feel like supporting Lumpy Touch, I'll leave a link in the description for their Patreon, so go check them out. Anyway, let's get back to the video. Now, some of you may remember a while back when I did a video on Lasagna Cat. And I remember a particular comic that Lasagna Cat went on about, where was the pipe? Let me tell you, Lumpy Touch has made a video on this comic strip, or at least I think so. Either that or it's gonna be something more creepier. But we should check out this video. This one's entitled, Now Where Could My Pipe Be? Now, I'm gonna try to make a little prediction. I think that the pipe is actually gonna be alive and it's gonna be eating Gorefield. Is, is, is that a messed up prediction? I feel like that's a really messed up prediction. <laughs> now where could my pipe be? Garfield? Garfield! Oh, you've really done it this time. Give me back my pipe this instant. Garfield! Garfield! Oh gosh, holy <laughs> crap! I like how you can see the green oh, screen Garfield. on that. Hey, trouble, Garfield. <laughs> oh. Odie, no! Odie, don't breathe it in! Odie! Garfield! Stop! Odie! Garfield's too going. Odie! It's okay! It's gonna be okay! to think after that video. That video just had so many twists and turns that I just was not expecting. And I don't know how to feel about that. Ah, but I found the most important comment in this video. Me <laughs> He's finally done it. Garfield in a non-creepy posture. I don't know, man. This face here doesn't necessarily say not creepy. I mean, it's better than Garfield, right? Eh. All right, so this next video we're gonna be checking out is entitled Turn me on. Turn me on. Turn, turn me on. What has my life become? Ah, yes, a computer screen. I have seen one of those before. Hi. Hey. This is gonna get sinister really quickly. I'll think about it, maybe. All right, now you're making it weird. Oh. The PlayStation started up sound, yes. But what's gonna happen? I feel like that's way more sinister than it came out as. Pausing this for a second, I, I just need to let out like a big scream. Oh, hold on, I need, I need to set the stage for this one, all right? I want you to know, headphone users, you're gonna wanna cover your ears for this one. Not with headphones, but just with literally anything else. <laughs> all right, I'm good. I, I am good. Lumpy Touch, you're still a genius, but like, what the heck, man? All right, so now that I've been terrified most of the time through this episode, I wanna see something that might make me happy. Towards the beginning of Lumpy Tet's career, they made a video entitled Bongo Cat Country, and I feel like it's gonna be nice and wholesome, and I, I really hope it is. I do not wanna get baited, so hopefully this is wholesome, okay? Hopefully this is wholesome.
I love that. That was so wholesome. Yes, I didn't get baited. Nothing creepy happened. It was just pure bongo cat. This is the greatest video of all time. I like how your channel went from cute bongo cat to ruining childhood memories. All right, we got time for one more video here. The title is that you, Luigi? For all that is holy, I hope it is Luigi. Huh? Hey, who's that? Is that you, Luigi? Yeah, I can see you over there. What are you doing? Why are you broaching me? You've been waiting all day to say it, I can tell. You've been waiting, and now you're gonna tell me. You don't have to. How about you don't? Oh. <laughs> Luigi, it's not gonna be funny. It's not gonna be funny. It's not gonna be worth all this time. Oh, don't you dare. Don't you dare say it. No, don't say it. I'm your brother. Oh, f you, Luigi. Why'd you, do <laughs> why'd you do it? Why'd you do it? I knew what you were going to say. It's not funny. Same thing. You're constantly saying the same thing. It's not funny at all. You walk away from me. You walk away in shame. Oh my shame God. You never do that again. <laughs> God, that was freaking beautiful. For those of that aren't familiar with it, every time that Luigi appears in a video, he always just says, I'm your brother, I'm your brother. <laughs> oh, that was too funny. <laughs> Alright, that's my favorite video of Love Me Touch has ever done. 100%. You guys, I gotta tell you something. Come here. I'm your brother. Oh, holy crap. All right, I thoroughly enjoyed my trip back into the Lumpy Touch world. You know what, Lumpy Touch? Uh, let me give you a heart to heart for a second. You are awesome. And I really do enjoy your art. Your creepy ones do make me scared, but hey, I do like your wholesome ones. The Bongo Cat one will forever be my favorite, though. Oh no, that freaking Luigi would freaking floored me. I don't think I've ever laughed that hard at a Lumpy Touch video ever. I'm your brother. <laughs> Just... <laughs> anyway, before I start laughing about that again, I thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed our triage back into the Lumpy Touch world because I really did. Thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like, hit that subscribe button, and be sure to let me know what other videos you'd like me to check out or what other creators you'd like me to check out as well. Thank you all again, and you all stay awesome. I could end up doing something stupid with my freaking hammer here. You would think that'd be great, right? Well, on the contrary, I'm not gonna do anything stupid. I'm gonna do something really freaking cool with it. Watch this. Hope y'all are ready for this one. <laughs>